Hello everybody, in this video I'm going to show you how to start Ghost Runner in DX12 or DirectX12. Uh, Ghost Runner does support DirectX12, uh, but you need to check whether or not your GPU can uh, support it or not. How do you do that? On the bottom left of your screen in search, type in run. This will come up, type in DXDIAG, DXDIAG, press enter. And your direct X uh, diagnostic tool will come up on the top. You're going to see display and feature levels on the right hand side. It's going to say 12 underscore 0, 1 and 2 or above. If it's 0 and above, it is compatible. And uh, if it is, if you don't have 12 uh, underscore anything, basically your GPU is probably not compatible with uh, direct X 12. Now, if uh, it is compatible, but you don't have it, there are a couple of ways to get it. The first way is to do the Windows update. It is included in the Windows update. Go to settings, Windows update, check for updates, and install the updates. And that should uh, give you the latest version of DirectX 12. If you've done that, you still don't have it. I'll put a link in the video description, but you can go to Microsoft.com right here and download it directly and then run it. Now, if you've done that and it still isn't using DirectX 12 for whatever reason, you can force it to use DirectX 12 by going into Steam Library, right click on it, go to Properties, General, Dash DX 12, and that forces the game to run in DirectX 12. By the way, DX 11 forces the game to run in DirectX 11, but let's do DirectX 12. What if you have the game but it's not on Steam? Well, you can add non-Steam games to Steam, so click add a game on the bottom, uh, click on add a non-Steam game, find it from this list here, add it to Steam, and then just repeat the steps I just told you. Okay, that should have fixed the problem. If it did, leave the video a like and please subscribe. Thank you very much.